The red, white, and blue of the American flag means something to me. Does it mean something to you? You see, if you don't understand the value of those colors, then I don't understand what you're doing here. And I certainly don't understand when people start putting all these additional colors on the flag as if there's someone special protecting American values. You're not. You're hired to do that. You're responsible to do that. That's your job. You don't get a special line on the flag because you think we're special. We're holding the, the risks for America. You're not. Every human being across America has to fight for the values of America, which is our Constitution, the laws that protect us all, that don't just get applied, applied to whoever we want to willy-nilly. They get applied to us all. The laws protect our rights, and our rights are being abused by politicians. We have to suffer through listening to these newscasts that are really boring to people because we're losing numbers in terms of people watching the federal government and what's going on there because the fucking people who are employed in our government are screwing us out of our rights, wanting to change every little fucking law we've got somewhere that protects our privacy rights, our medical rights, our access to health care that we choose for us. This is fundamental treaty stuff. I mean, international treaty stuff. The Human Rights Declaration makes it very clear, unless we got a sub fucking Muslim that's changing that website and saying, oh, we're not going to use that clause anymore. I just don't feel like having it there. And I've seen that. Over the course of maybe three years, I used to have an actual copy in my travels of that document. And then all of a sudden, somebody put yellow highlighter on it. I'm like, who the hell did that? And then it disappeared completely several times when I was in Indiana, when I was in Ohio, and when I was in Illinois. I'm like, who the fuck are you to get into my briefcase and take my stuff? But that's where we are today. We have thieves in America. Shocker. They've been here since the Indian days of old, and we're in the midst of the Midwest, so we are absolutely on the plains where the Indians used to be, but we're not out here to be screwed over by any person who feels like it. Do you like that happening to you? Do you like being stolen from in your house? Do you like to have your money depleted from your bank accounts by some total stranger? Do you like your identity taken and someone pretending and parading around a community acting as you and creating false records? I doubt you do. So stop doing that. 